ahead. Here we are. Last one of the season at home. Um, 41 home games in front of these fans. What's their volume meant as far as the impact for guys on the bench and the critical moments and shifts during games? Well, it, our, our fans have been awesome all the way through, right from uh, right from the uh, the first game of the season all the way through. Uh, they make this an awesome atmosphere to play in. Our players, our players love it, um, you know, and that's uh, that's that that's part of growing and building together. And like I said, our fans have made this one of the best buildings to play in in the National Hockey League. Yeah. Saw them strong. Is that correct? Yes. All the changes. Yeah. Well, Pouliot will be in as well. Pouliot will be in as well, obviously. What have been some of the highlights for you that you've seen throughout the season from this team in this inaugural year? Uh, I'd, I'd, I'd prefer to get to those on Tuesday or Wednesday when we have our postseason. I'll be honest, with you, I mean, today the focus is on what we're doing. I mean, this is still, this is, you know, this is the business of, uh, you know, going out and winning a hockey game. So, I haven't reflected a whole lot on that. You know, there's uh, there'll be a time for that for sure, um, and that you know that time will come after the next couple of days. But right now, um, you know, it's it's about staying in, staying in the fight here um, and, and making sure we're ready and prepared to play tonight. You know, we've lost a few games, you know, three games in a row here. Um, you, you know, we want to end on a good note here tonight. So this is about tonight's performance. Is that the message of the team? Uh, you worry about them starting to wander. Off no, we talked, uh, honestly, we talked about we did our review of of the game last game, you know, and I sat here two days ago and said, you know, that our puck play is going to dictate how we feel after this one. And I'll be honest with you, I was wrong. Our puck play was good. We generated a ton of offense. Uh, we gave up very little, but what we did was way too easy, you know. So, you know, we it's a normal morning. We we addressed what we have to, you know, what we have to shore up tonight. Um, and and what we need to do to to win a hockey game here tonight. Dave, as far as the younger guys who are still looking to carve a role for this next season, how much more do you expect them to push, or more so just to treat this more who, like more of the same? Who, who would that like? You got to be like, who are the young guys? I guess. Well, just, 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 just uh, for example, Colin. You know, we got called up recently, back in off of injury, for a game like this for him. Are you looking for more from him or, or just more of the same? Uh, well, consistency, you know, we talked about it a few days ago, you know, for a guy like Cole. Um, you know, t you know, 200 foot, you know, consistent hockey, you know, hockey game. Um, he's coming off of, you know, a couple nights out of the lineup. Uh, so he needs to come back in tonight and, and do exactly what I talked about earlier, help be part of, you know, helping us win a hockey game. So, um, it's not. It, I mean, it's not all about one night for any of these guys. You know, for for a guy like Cole, it's certainly not about one night. He has a decent body of work. I'd like to see him keep building on that. You know, at the end of the day, decisions for next year are going to be made. You know, for the guys that are back and back in training camp, those decisions are going to be made next year. But the impressions that are left uh, from. Uh, you know, from the past few weeks, uh, as well as from tonight, uh, those you know those last. Earlier in the season, you had a comment about someone had asked you if guys were really having that much fun in this building. You know, as teams have come in and had their first nights here, as we you know approach you know the final night, have you heard more comments from other people around the league still asking you about the atmosphere in this building, or is it just? Uh, I I haven't in that regard. Um, you know, but I can tell you. I mean, I've been around. You know, been around the league a, a few different times, and this building is awesome. You know, the uh, the atmosphere in the building is great. Um, you know, every single night it's you know it's it's packed to the brim, and um, that's that you know that's a great atmosphere to play in. Great, thank you. Thanks, Dave. Thanks, Dave.